2010, companies that want to do research in space might be able to lease an inflatable space station like this one from Bigelow Aerospace. The two modules at the back would provide a workspace of over 300 cubic meters each. In 2006, Bigelow launched a small prototype called Genesis 1. Here is a view of the Earth's rotation from the spacecraft. A second prototype called Genesis 2 was launched in June 2007. This was one of the first high-resolution images sent down to Earth from one of its 22 cameras. The spacecraft also took up a biobox with ant farms, scorpions, and Madagascar hissing cockroaches. Genesis 1 and 2 were both launched from the Yazny base in Russia, atop a Russian booster rocket. Once in orbit, the craft is controlled from Bigelow's Mission Control Center in Las Vegas. Communications antennas help it keep in touch and cameras on the solar panels give views of the exterior of the craft. Once in space, the outer shell inflates with air, doubling its initial size. The performance of the prototypes is being monitored so that the designs can be perfected. Genesis 1 is supposed to stay in space for 5 years and Genesis 2 for 12.